Hey everybody, Spoonvet here, and I'm with a, a tool this time, uh, not a mission. And the tool is uh, Piranha, and Piranha is actually made by, I, don't know, I think a French guy. It's it's already old, uh, it's like three years old, but it still works. Um, basically what it was designed to do was test SMTP vulnerabilities and like filters, ba basically content filters. And it's too bad the original paper is offline, so uh, I, there's not much I can I can tell you about it. The only thing um, I'll just run it, and I'll probably spam myself to death. But who cares? Let's try. It. So basically, what you do is mandatory are E H and A, optional are uh, the rest. So E exploit number. So you can you choose one of these exploits, and I chose randomly for the LHA get header directory name overflow then uh, SMTP server to test which is my own server don't worry then A is destination email uh, this is destination email that I'm using for programming then the shell code which is a UDP reverse shell then a C which is a cloaking style I do no cloaking because you can do it in a Viagra spam or look at pictures I promised you which uh, yeah, I'm just gonna do no. Uh, D1 is uh, for vanishing techniques, and I'll do the multipart alternative trick. Then V is attaching a virus for um, attach iCar virus to improve stealthness. So let's do that. Sounds cool. Um, Z uh, or Z is pack all the marijuana into the tarball to be less noisy. Uh, ports is to port using reverse shell or bind shell, which is just a random port I gave. And the L is the host connect back in reverse shell mode, which is uh, my like wireless local host here. And if you want this to work, you need to um, redirect your router, open a port, in this case UDP port uh, 3434, and connect that through to UDP port 192.168.1.7 on port 3434. So let's just uh, run this and see what it does. So uh, virusicar.com will be attached to the email. I have no idea what it does, but it sounds pretty fucking awesome, actually. Um, I could, like, really quickly, of course, check it out. Icar virus. Yeah, let's just check it out. This will be running anyway in the background, so who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Access for no internet. Firefox. Firefox. Do do do. I have no idea if I'm going to be spamming the crap out of me, actually. That would be funny if I got, like, I don't know, a hundred messages in one go. Uh, what is this? Alright, so I have no idea what this, this iCar virus is. Um, it sounds pretty awesome, but as this is going on for a while, let's just let's just go on the internet and find out what it is. iCar virus. Did I spell it correctly or not? Yeah, iCar virus. Oh, the iCar test file. Official name is standard standard antivirus test file. Oh, that one. Okay then. Yeah, I know that one. It's a file that's been designed. Yes, this is the string that. Yes, 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 yes. I sent this string as well to my uh, server for because I need the spam assassin and stuff like that. Oh, I didn't know that was iCar. Uh, learned something. All right, so failed to connect to mail server connection timed out. All right, then I'm going to change it slightly and actually make it um, on port 25 let's go this is probably right because you cannot connect to my mail server 
I'm guessing, because you need uh, legitimate um, logins. It's not an open web service, it's not open relay. So I'm guessing this will fail again as well. Field connected server connection timeout. Yeah. What we can do. Um, but I need to check something for that first. Is um, the mail servers of Hotmail are open, and we do have a Hotmail account. But I need to check which Hotmail account I have. So, one moment. Alright, so I figured out which one I've got. The rest can stay the same. Because I don't want to spam anybody else. Alrighty then. Um, NX1.hotmail.com if this doesn't work then that's fine I mean like I said this is an old tool so I'm guessing this is actually to be used in um, like um, great no crystal box or gray box testing where you know your environment that you're going to and not just a random black box where you don't know anything but anyway I thought I'd I show this tool. I mean, it's in there. It's it's pretty cool. Um, I, I think they're called mx one .com, Actually, not quite sure. Open tab. mx one .com, Alright, that doesn't sound very good. Doesn't look to be right. Hmm. Go away. Let's try two. I think overall I had success with with four was it four or five one or two oh five doesn't exist anymore all right no, cool. doesn't matter um anyway yeah, that's the uh, the old two piranha and um uh, you guys try it out on your own uh, email server.